So the third part of the Senator is a scammer on Safari is finally here. During the upload you'll hear a number of calls between the Senator and Mr Rice and also the Safari Hotel manager Jeffrey Smith plus Jeffrey Smith's driver Randy Tom. The first call you'll hear now is in the morning uh, before the Senator makes his way across the border back to Benin. Enjoy. Good morning. I just woke up so I thought I would call you. Okay. I have called uh, Mr. Geoffrey. So what we agreed, he said that uh, for them to come to Sene will take a lot of time. That I should try my best and uh, come to Kotonou. Okay. Then that uh, the, the driver is coming to Kotonou to pick me. If I get there, I should call him. So you tell the driver because I left uh, first tax. Nigeria, since morning, I'm on my way now to, to, to Seme border, right? So, you tell the driver to warm and not coming to Tope. To come to, to, is it Bank of Africa? To come to Tope. Tope. Huh? That is what they call it now, to the Tope. Tope? Tope, Tope. Okay. I I will call you in a few hours. What time will you be there and I'll call you? In, 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 by 11 I'll be there. So I don't want to waste time because first I'm going back to, uh, to Abuja today and I know that you're going back to the UK so that we can be able to meet. I don't want to waste time. Yeah, I don't I, I'm going back in the time. evening now because of this delay. I changed my flight. So I will leave. Okay. I will leave uh, Benin Republic at about seven o'clock this evening. So, I'm. So you want me to give you a call in about two and a half hours then? Yes. I because as soon as I meet you, I have to leave immediately to go back because of my work tomorrow. Okay. I did not go to work on Friday, and if I fail to go work on Monday. I'll have problem. My boss will not even be happy. I told him that I just want to give you a second chance to come back again, that you ask me to come back. So please, I, I'm begging of you. If this is a sort of uh, uh, game or sort, let me know. Let me just relax myself and go back to Abuja. Well, uh, I don't understand that, sir. But um, I will call you in about two hours, two and a half hours, and then when you are outside Bank of Africa, I will tell the hotel management to call you so that they can confirm you're there and pick you up. Okay. Okay. I'm almost, I'm almost close to, to semi border. How long and does it take I... to get across the border? Well, uh, that's what I'm thinking now because uh, as for the fact that I don't have passports, uh, we have some hinges, some bricks, and uh, have to pay them some money if I leave. That was why I was saying that uh, they, they would have come to send my brother to pick me up. But uh, Mr. Geoffrey said that uh, that wasn't our agreement yesterday, that uh, the place is far, and uh, which I know from there to Tokwe is very, very far. So. Uh, I'll, be, I'll, I'll, I'll just give him the benefit of doubt and going to Tokme, which is Cotonou. So how long do, how long does it take you to get from Seme border to Cotonou? From Seme border to Cotonou should be about forty five minutes. Okay, I'll call you back at about maybe ten to eleven, quarter to eleven, and see where you are. But make sure your phone will connect because last time when I tried ringing you, your phone wouldn't connect. I don't know anywhere here. I don't know anywhere in Kotonou. That was why I was seriously afraid yesterday when they took me to Bush. That uh, the place they said you are there, the Sarafa, Sarafa, Sarafa Hotel is, is very, very bushy. So I, I have not been to that place before. That's in between Kotonou and uh, Togo. So you can see the, the, the difference is very, very, very risky. The phone is with me. There is, and if I stayed there by 11 o'clock, 30, 12 o'clock, I did not see anyone. I'm going back and nobody can call me to come back.
packaging. It, it's, uh, don't worry, we've got there. we've got a driver that will pick you up. I've already spoke to them. Don't worry. Okay. God oh, bless you. Okay. And I'll call you in about two hours. Okay. Bye. Bye. So now the senator has made his way back across the international border and finds himself in Benin Republic. As you've heard, he's completely out of his comfort zone. He doesn't know anyone there. Uh, and yesterday he was afraid for his life when uh, a taxi driver took him into the bush to find the non-existent safari hotel. Now, if you look at your screens, you will see a Google image uh, and a Google map of where the senator actually went to meet with Mr. Rice. The reason that he went to a pharmacy de therapy. Uh, is because he needed a phone and had to awkwardly approach the pharmacy's security guard to borrow his phone to call Mr Rice. A fun fact to consider is that this call uh, happened on the 1st of December 2019 and the first time the Senator and Mr Rice communicated with each other was on the 1st of June 2018. So I thought, it's our 18 month anniversary Let's make it one to remember. Hello, Kingsley. Yes, Mr. Price. In Cotonou now. Okay. This is not my number. Is the office where I am staying, waiting for your driver? I collected the phone of uh, the, the the security to call you. Right. Can I speak with the security, please? He doesn't understand English. Just put him oh, on the phone. Yeah. Put him on the phone. Hello. Hello? Hey? Hi. Is it... Pharmacy car therapy, Papa. Not bank, this is a uh, pharmacy. Pharmacy car therapy. It's hey, a... Papa. Yeah, hey, pharmacy, pharmacy, that is where I am. Okay. So, what do you want to hear? Okay, what is the name of the pharmacy? I don't speak French. The name is... What is the name of it? therapy. 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 And it's in Togba. Yeah, Togba. Togba. Oh, I will. I will. I will SMS you the name of the pharmacy. Okay, right. S SMS me the name. Right. Hello, sir. Yes. Is is it called pharmacy therapy therapy? What type of interrogation is that? If you are not coming, tell me I'm going back. I no. don't have all this time to wait. No, because I told you where I am. Come here and pick me up. I'll stop asking you questions. <laughs> no, sir. The problem is in Tokba, in Tokba, there is more than five pharmacies. So we just need to make sure that you are at the right one. So if I call the one I have said is the one that they have sent this the test to you. That is where I am. I'm standing here. Go the, inside. The first pharmacy in Papa is. There are different different names. Mister Rice, I I am talking to you now. If you don't, I'm as soon as I drop this and I'm leaving. All this place is so far. I can't continue on here. You've been interrogating me. You're sitting one place interrogating me. What we discuss is if I get to continue, you, I will tell you where I am. You come and pick me up. No, they are asking me to tell this, tell this. They don't speak English. What do you want me to do? Right, calm down, first of all. Please calm down. Everything is fine. You are going the to... The they have here is pharmacies this, for the, 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 the one I, I tested to you. Come there, you'll see me all, uh, outside the pharmacy. They are just helping me to, to, so that I will be able to stay and wait for you. And you are there asking me I should go to pharmacies as you tell them to speak in. Do what? Because then we will know. That I'm buying something. I just stand behind them so that anybody that is going to pick me will know the, the place to come and pick me. Then I, I go along with him. The people inside the pharmacy does not even know that I am here. I am only here with the security. So Sir, they're you don't me to do things that I don't want to do. I am calling to this number. Is the security outside? I beg him to give me his number because my number is not going. Right, calm down. Calm down, okay. Please just calm down. Mr. Wise, I can see that that joke you have been playing. I just wanted to give you the benefits of that coming here today. I am going. As soon as I drop this phone now, I'm going. I well, can see that you are not serious. 
let me get Jeffrey to call you. We'll have to send the driver then. I'm going to have to send the driver, but you are, you need to make sure that you are at pharmacy for therapy, number four therapy. I've already given you the address. Yeah, I know. I'm outside waiting for you. I think you need to go inside. I want to talk to this, you want to talk to that. Do you have any business with anybody inside the office? Stay there. I'm going to have to send the driver to pick you up. I'm going to get the driver to call you, okay? Okay. Okay, bye. Give me ten minute, five minutes, okay? This is Jeffrey. Okay. Okay, my 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 driver from the hotel is coming down to pick you up. Okay, how long will you take him? Because uh, I'm like I told you earlier, I have to go. I have to go so that I will I get my own thing back to Abuja today. Yeah, yeah. Maybe he may be twenty minutes or half an hour. Okay. His name is Mr. I Randy know. Tom. Okay, I tested in the the house is where I am staying. They are the frontage. And this uh, phone number is the phone number of the security. Yeah, I have to beg him and put for credit some credit for him so that we can be able to talk. Okay. Okay, well the driver is on his way. Hello? Yes, what happened there? What happened? Hello? Can you hear, you hear me? Yes. Okay, the driver is on his way. Okay. Thank you. Hello? Kingsley, it's Mr. Rice. I am in the car. I'm in the car. We're coming to get you. We are in nearly in Tokpa. We are, we are? We are on the way. We are nearly in Tokpa. The manager... The manager that I am with, who is driving me to meet you and then driving you back to the Safari Hotel, he is Nigerian, like you. He is Nigerian. His name is Mr. Randy Tom. Mr. Randy Tom. He's just going to say hello to you, but we're nearly in Tokpa. Mr. Randy, say hello. This is Mr. Randy Tom speaking, Safari Hotel manager. So, how do I help you? I am the more in the Safari Hotel. Okay. So? Yes, I'm, I'm on my way now, coming there. I'm nearly getting there. I'm coming with one of my officials. Uh-huh. The next 10 to 20 minutes will be there. The it, it is no longer uh, 30 minutes again. I can see that you people are playing games with me. How about? No, I sir. I want to know where you are. Hold on. Kingsley. Listen, I don't, I am, I am sick and tired of your games, right? As I'm speaking with you, immediately I drop this and I'm going. What, sir, but we're in the car. Me. You, 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 are, you are just fooling yourself, thinking that you're fooling me. No, sir, we are in the car. You just spoke to the manager. We are in the car. We are nearly in Tokba. What, what concerns me with that? I have spoken with the manager. Are you in the same bus with the manager? Yes. Or do you think that I'm a fool? I'm in the car with him, sir. You are in the car with the, the, with the manager? Yes, Mr. Randy Tom. Uh -huh. So in the next 15 minutes, you and your officials are coming to do what? We're going to pick... Or what? We're going to pick you up, sir. You guys are not serious. Mr. Geoffrey has spoken in his own and said that in 10, in 20, 30 minutes. This is 30 something minutes now. None of you have shown. This is what you did yesterday. Now it's for me to come and wait the whole day here. At the end, then I will miss my job tomorrow. Is it not? <laughs> okay, I'm waiting. 10, 15 minutes, I'm waiting. Okay, bye bye. I'm more in your safari hotel. I don't worry if you like. Be the director of the Supply Hotel or whatever thing you call the hotel. To start with, I, I heard that the hotel is not in existence. My coming today is just to 
to just complete all righteousness. If not, all I that I have here today shows that that hotel is not a victim. And after yes. 20 minutes, I, I did not see any of you here. I'm sorry, I have yes. to leave. What do you want have job to do? 10 minutes, sir. Yeah, sir, one minute now. We are one minute away. We are around the corner, okay? Are you still stood outside? Do what? One minute away. We are one minute away. Are you still stood outside? We are around the corner. I am leaving. I don't have all this your time. Right. From 10 minutes, from 30 minutes to 15 minutes, 15 minutes to 10 minutes, 10 minutes to 1 minute. I can see that you people are just playing games. No. I have to leave. No, sir. Mr. Randy wants to speak with you. We are 30 seconds away. I can see you now. I can see you now. Mr. Randy. Keep quiet there. You are talking. You know who you are talking to. Keep quiet when I talk. You listen to me. I said you are an idiot. Your father and your mother are an idiot. <laughs> After an entire weekend travelling across borders, paying bribes, having his phone confiscated off him, fearing for his life, thinking he's been kidnapped, standing around for hours and hours in boiling heat, I thought it was only appropriate that I call the Senator later that evening when he'd returned home to Lagos. Please note that when he answers the phone this time, he's answering the phone as the Senator and not Kingsley. So, in effect, he's just talking about himself in the third person. Hello? Yes? Sir, it's Mr Rice. How are you? Don't call this number again. And everything about this transaction finished. Don't ever call this number again. Why? I have found out that you are a criminal. You are a joker. Why this are you... This is the second time now you made this stupid act. You, you gave Kinsley a wrong address, gave me wrong information to give the gentleman that left Abuja and to Kotonou, only for you to go and mess him around, right? Sir, I don't understand. What happened? What happened? Don't ask me that stupid question. What happened to Kingsley this weekend? What happened? Your father happens to him. You don't have any good thing to do. Instead, you are trying to put, you are looking for someone to kill, isn't it? That was why you asked him to come back yesterday night to go to work, to, to, to go to New, after you must have messed him up. You go and work with whoever you want to work with. Don't you ever call my number again. But I want to work. I want to work with you and and Mr. Kingsley. We have nothing to do with you. How do we work this out from here? Of all those your criminal acts, you did it the first time at Eddie's hotel. I sent someone, and you went around and start misbehaving. At the end of it, you deny that you never did anything of such. Now you did it again. Asking the gentleman to leave his duty work from Abuja down to Benin Republic. Only for you to go there and gang up some criminals, some hoodlums like you. When do I get the contract, sir? You get it in your mother's pussy. I'll start. And that brings an end to the Senator is a Scammer. Thank you all for watching, please like, share and subscribe and there will be more fun soon.